Hearing from the Jayhawks today in KBC Nice. Dennis Evans made the trip. He joins us live. Uh, Dennis, the question everybody wants answered was there a coach self signing today? You know, Coach Self today was sort of like Bigfoot. Everyone, and I do mean everyone inside of this arena, from the fans, the media, everyone just wanted to catch a glimpse of him today, but no such luck. Everyone wanted to see the coach as he was making his return. Well, we do have good news. Barring something really unexpected, Coach Self is expected to be on the bench for tomorrow's game against Howard University. Now, the defending national champs went through an hour-long public workout here at the Wells Fargo Arena. The Jayhawks are the top seed in the West region. The team a lot looks loose. They were relaxed and they look ready for tomorrow's game. And even though Coach Self was a no show for the public workout, the players say he has been with them at the practices that really count. It's great, um, you know, just having him back around, um, you know, us and pushing us every day now, um, you know, it's great to have our leader back with us. And, uh, you know, we're looking forward to him coaching us. Well, the top seed Jayhawks get to play the 16th seed. That's the Howard Bison, the HBCU from Washington, D.C., much more known for their famous alums than for their basketball team. They haven't been to the big dance since 1992. This year's team is 22 and 12. And Howard, I watched them practice today. They are athletic. They are good, and they have lots of confidence, but they just don't have the size to match up against KU, so that's bad news for them. The other bad news is Coach Self is expected to be with the Jayhawks tomorrow as they get ready to kick off their run at back-to-back -back championships here in Des Moines. Live in Des Moines, Iowa, Dennis Evans, KBC 9 News.